Hey tribe, what's up? Welcome to Leo Love Readings. This is a reading for Cancer and Cancer Cross Watchers. Okay, I've already prepared the decks. So we're going to go ahead and just get started. We're going to take a look at what your person has to say to you, okay? All right, thank you guys for all of your likes, shares, subscriptions, your beautiful comments, your donations and your bookings, all of those things, or any of those things on their own, really helps our channel to grow a lot, okay? Um, wow, this is a beautiful message, Cancer. So, they want you to know that they are, they're currently heartbroken. They're heartbroken without you. This person doesn't want to be without you. They want to come in and give you this love offer. And they're going to do it. This is a night. So this is um, energy that is already um, happening. It's like this person, they already have like the plans made and everything. Like it, it's just a matter of time before it actually happens. This person has already made the decision that they're going to come in and give you this love offer. See, we have, we have him giving the cup twice here. And so this could be somebody who you have dealt with in the past. Um, it could be a friend, possibly someone who, it could be an ex. It's possible in this case. Um, I would say that's possible. Um, but this is a past life soulmate, and it could also be someone that you knew as a child, like a um, somebody who you grew up with or you knew when you were young, but also... This is just saying, like, this person is missing you. Like, they are so nostalgic. Six of Cups is nostalgia, and with the Knight of Cups and the Three of Swords, this person is heartbroken without you. Like, they miss you. They have so many beautiful memories of you. They're thinking about you in such a beautiful, loving way, in a very innocent, nostalgic way sort of way. I'm hearing this person wants to protect you. Um, and we also have the three of pentacles. So this person, um, they're, like I said, they're working on it. Like they've already put this work in with the divine. Like they're, this is this person like making this plan. Like these are concrete plans. These are things that this person has actually had to do. There are action steps that this person has taken. Um, they're also wanting you to know that they want this to work. Like, they want to compromise with you. They want to... That was weird that that word compromise just came out because I'm not feeling that energy. But that was the word that came out, okay? So, if you guys had some sort of disagreements in the past or there were some reasons why it didn't work before and this person was um, not compromising with you, like... They want to do that now, but I'm not really feeling that. I'm feeling more like they want to be with you. They want to work with you. They want to, and I don't necessarily feel it in a business sense either. I feel it more like they want it to just be you and them and God. Like that's what this person is, is working towards. It's what they actually want. They're trying to, it's hard for them because they're, they're in a lot of pain. This person has really deep feelings, okay? This person feels things really, really deeply. And they're feeling like for some reason you're not going to take them back or you're not going to accept their offer if this is a new person. So they're trying to prepare something. Like, they want to come with more than just their heart on their sleeve, which they're going to have here with this Knight of Cups. It could also be a secret admirer. Like I said, it could be a friend. It could be someone who you don't maybe realize, like, feels this way about you. Um, and on the bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Wands. So this is a new beginning. It's the it's like the beginning of a new cycle, and it's it's a wand. So it's about action. There's a lot of here about a lot of there is a lot here about action. So this person, they're not just you know, they don't want to just come in and say all the right things. 
I don't know if maybe this person did this in the past, but they're they're not. I keep getting like this energy of maybe the way they handled things before was not, they realize now it was not the best way to handle it. So now this person wants to actually do things. This is a new start of a new cycle of actual like activity. Things actually happening. Okay, not just feelings or not just thoughts or memories or nostalgia or even, you know, like sweet conversation or any kind of conversation. It's it's more than that. You're this person wants you to know that they they're gonna come through with the moves. They're gonna come they're gonna pull up. They're gonna come through with the actual goods. Um, this person is also extremely attracted to you, and, um, this is the hand of the divine here. So, this person has prayed for you. Like, this person has literally prayed for you. And God is saying, okay. Yeah. You're you they they love you. They love you, but they love your energy. See, she's got this white I'm sorry, this yellow hood. The white is the lilies. Um, but the yellow represents happiness, joy, bliss. They see you as Someone who is very positive, maybe very loving, very upbeat, possibly. Like, you see the brighter side of things, and they love that about you so much. Um, and they really, really want to make you happy, and that is what they intend to do.